And so how did I translate it? I, it was translation that was difficult. It was a translation which had all kinds of uh, um, uh, blocks and hurdles because I kept looking for that other Ismat and I kept finding this other Ismat. And I too had to elevate my own language or the language I was used to translating in when I was doing Ismat's other work. So I was correspondingly working with Ismat, which is what I always do, regardless koi bhi writer hai. So I work, I mean, I wanted to hear her voice in my ear. So I hear her voice in my ear and then I translate. And so the translation process becomes a journey in itself with the writer. You know, you are in tow, you're, the writer is in front of you and you're behind the writer and you hear everything and you feel everything. And so you accommodate your language. So it was a learning process for me in terms of uh, the uh, 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 translation um, techniques and strategies.